Hi, my name is Nyla Leger, and I'm going to be explaining principles used for culturing and characterizing microorganisms with the model bacteria Fabier fischieri. Fabier fischieri is a bioluminescent marine bacterium that is co-evolved with Hawaiian bobtail squids. When we culture bacteria and their cells grow in number, they need nutrients. Nutrients for bacteria may include certain things that we may just consider a given of the environment. This includes key elements like phosphorus, nitrogen, and carbon to make things like DNA and phospholipid cell membranes. Micronutrients like trace minerals and transition metals serve catalytic roles for enzymes involved in cellular pathways. To keep bacteria at exponential or maximum growth, as seen in the bacterial growth curve chart, bacteria need nutrients and essential factors like water and oxygen in constant supply. Fabier fischieri's optimal nutrients were tested for the best light emission in both broths and solid agar slants. The conclusive data shows that Vibrio fischieri thrives on a mixture of yeast, beef extract, glycerol, monosodium phosphate, and peptones. Beef amino acids provide nitrogen, and the yeast and glycerol act as carbon sources. You can also see that the Vibrio fischieri is an obligate arrow based on its growth only on the surface of the agar slants where oxygen is available. The broth must be constantly aerated to supply enough oxygen. Vibrio fischieri need this constant supply of proteins, carbohydrates, arginine micronutrients, etc. because it is used to getting these nutrients from its host, the Hawaiian bobtail squid. You can, uh, different bacteria require different salt concentrations. Most are non-halophiles and require a minimal 1% to none to survive. Marine bacteria require at least some NaCl around 1-4%. This is because the ocean water is naturally 3% NaCl or 35 ppt grams per kilogram. Halotolerant exists between non-halophiles and halophiles thriving at minimal concentrations. Facultative halophiles do the opposite and thrive at high concentrations but can still live at 2% NaCl. These are not on the chart. Extreme halophiles all the way to the right of the chart need the most NaCl to live at 15 to 30%. Fabia fischieri, as you may have seen in the graph, are halophiles. Their optimal NaCl concentrations have been found to range from 24 to 38 ppt by the same studies that found their optimal media nutrients. Fabia fischieri live in the light organ of Hawaiian bobtail squid, which indeed has a lower NaCl concentration than ocean water at 35 ppt, which matches Fabia fischieri's optimal NaCl concentration at 28 ppt or between 24 to 38. These are my references. Thank you for watching.